Thanks to Detroit police, a seven-year-old boy found wandering the streets of southwest Detroit has now been reunited with his mother. Such good news tonight. Yeah. 7 Action News reporter Aaron Baskerville joins us live from the department's 4th Precinct with the details on how this little boy got lost in the first place. Hi, Aaron. Hey, Carolyn, an awful story, a scary story, a parent's worst nightmare. Child Protective Services is now investigating. The mother wanted absolutely nothing to do with us tonight, but thankfully, officers were able to find her son on the streets. Were you able to talk to him or say anything? He seemed in good spirits. That's the mother of seven-year-old Malik Jones avoiding questions tonight. Her son was found crying on the street by officers near Fisher Service Drive on the city's southwest side. After police believe he hopped on his sister's bike and left his house on Central this afternoon. He looked to be in good health, mental and physical health. Uh, he's very active, very smart, and has a very active imagination. Investigators say it took more than three hours to finally locate the mother after she saw the missing alert on social media. Obviously, I don't parents care make what it is. I don't care what it is. Just please get away from me. I need my space. Right now, CPS has started its own investigation into how many, if any, adults were in the house when Malik left and if there were other kids inside. We're told the mother is not talking about where she was when this all went down. Yeah. Malik seemed to be in good spirits tonight. Officers just happy the boy is safe. It is very important to us that we find a parent because no child should be out there left alone wandering for our whatever amount of time. The boy was reunited with his mother away from cameras tonight. Police do not know how long he was actually on the streets. His mother received a ticket tonight. For now, we're live in Detroit, Aaron Baskerville, 7 Action News. All right, Aaron.